I'm just kidding. Hey guys, Oliver Windows here. Today I'm going to be showing you how to install MSN Messenger on actual hardware, on modern hardware. So basically, it's not that difficult at all. Uh, it's it's like easier than Phoenix. They actually Phoenix is actually trying to get MSN Messenger to work for their servers, but it wouldn't let me sign in no matter what I did. So I'm just forced to do my own thing here. Fortunately, there's another uh, website that actually does do MSN Messenger. And I'm pretty sure they have other thing options as well. But without further ado, let's get on with the tutorial. So first, what you're wanting to do is open your browser. You go to escargo.chat. The link will be down in the description. Next, what you want to do is you want to go up here and register your account. Or if you want to, you can scroll down and read through all this stuff, see what's all supported. Uh, they, they support all the way up to Windows Live Messenger 2009. After you sign up, uh, they'll send you a verification email. Uh, you may not get it immediately, it may take a few minutes depending on how slow their servers are going. Most of the time it's it's okay, it took it a few minutes for it to send it to me, to my spam folder. Make sure you check your spam folder. But next what you want to do is you're going to want to go up here, click on download. You click on MSN slash Windows Live Messenger. You select whatever language of your choice. In my case, it is English. Then you can scroll down here and you can download whichever version they have to offer. Uh, they've got like unpatched versions of everything and they tell you how to patch it. Or they have their own installer that's already pre-patched. So what I do, what I'm going to do is you just, I'm just going to download it. If you have an antivirus, especially built into your browser, you can just ignore this and continue to the website. It's going to download automatically. So what you're going to want to do next is extract. Then you're going to want to run this, escargo-wlm. Make sure to press yes. And then you get the setup wizard here. You just push install. In my, uh, you can ignore this. This is just because I have it installed already. All right. Make sure to uncheck this because if you don't, then it, I mean, it doesn't do anything. You just got to make sure that uh, Windows Live Messenger is completely off. Uh, but then you click finish. And then down here, you click on run after install. So basically what this does is um, it basically patches everything just in case it's already not patched. So this is a just in case process. Just go ahead and patch all. And then you can close out of this, close out of this. You can get off the website and you're done. Now you can open up Windows Live Messenger or uh, MSN Messenger, uh, whatever choice you have. Next, what you're wanting to do here is you're wanting to type in your uh, screen name you selected and then put the at symbol and then put escargo.chat. And then you type in your password and then you can check any of these, it doesn't really matter. And then you just push sign in. And there you go. You are officially signed in to Escargo's Windows Live Messenger or MSN Messenger. Uh, what's really cool about Escargo is they have this, like everything on here is custom made basically like to work to this day. Um, as you can see, it's Friday, April 14th, 2023. They got some cool little links here you can click on, uh, fun facts. They got links down here to like their Facebook, their YouTube, Actually, this is just YouTube in general, Facebook in general. It's like its own little mini browser. It's the weather. Let's not look at that. And then, but down here, these actually have like cool little animations for it as well, which is really, really neat. Um, you can obviously, you can customize your own image, put whatever image you want here. I'll set this all up l uh, later on down the road, but it still has the Windows Vista pictures. So obviously I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna choose a dog for now. And yeah, you are officially in Windows Live Messenger. Um, so in case anybody would like to know, I'm currently setting up three new channels for the MSN Messenger stuff. So here I'm going to be putting in, uh, in uh, instructions on how to set this up properly. Uh, here is where people can share their usernames. And here is where you, you could say uh, if you have any issues or just have any questions or anything like that. But yeah, that's pretty much it. 
Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure you click that like button, subscribe if you're new. Uh, go down in the description to uh, check this out for yourself, or you can, uh, you know, check out any other links I, uh, to join my Discord server or anything else I have down there. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I will see you guys later. Goodbye, guys.